guys. This is exciting. 815 on our Monday morning. Welcome back everyone today. National Grilled Cheese Day. It's a favorite for many, of course, but some struggle with how to make the perfect gooey cheese center without burning the bread. I'm speaking from experience. Joining us with some tips and tricks is the Willy Wonka of grilled cheese today. Chef for greater grilled cheese. Joseph Karadakis is joining us to give more details on a giveaway for a golden ticket for free grilled cheese uh, per month for a year. Good morning. Thanks for being with us. You're also going to give us some tricks on how to make these delicious grilled cheese sandwiches that you've brought to us. Good morning, Joseph. Hey, Evan. Good morning. Thank you for having me. Of course. Thank you for being with us and thank you for bringing all of this awesome food. We have different layouts here of your options uh, from your location. And the first question that I have, like I said, is just general advice on making that perfect grilled cheese sandwich. What makes the perfect sandwich? I, I know this is going to sound like it's like super plain, but get good quality sourdough bread, good quality cheese, and just a good quality butter. Is does these three ingredients make a huge difference in how somebody makes a grilled cheese? So Remember to start your pan on medium heat. Do not go super high heat because then what you just described is going to happen. You're going to burn the bread without melting the cheese. Use ample butter. It's going to take a lot of butter to make a crusty bread on the outside and a, and a gooey grilled cheese on the inside. And feel free to add any quirky ingredients you feel to make your grilled cheese special. I know myself, I had spaghetti and meatballs uh, on Saturday and on Sunday I made myself a meatball sub grilled cheese sandwich. It was super good. I'm also looking at some of your guys' options that you brought in, the Philly grilled cheese, cordon bleu, lobster, chicken pesto. I mean, what are some of the most popular grilled cheese sandwiches at your guys' uh, greater grilled cheese location? Well, the, the lobster grilled cheese is something that we've been doing ever since we were a food truck, back in our food truck days. Uh, it's our most popular, best-selling item. It's what we're known for. Uh, short after that comes the Philly grilled cheese, very rich in flavor, has all the caramelized onions and the red bell peppers inside. Um, but right now, the most popular item is our Piria grilled cheese. It's just a, a combination of that super flavorful Mexican stew that everybody sees on their Instagram videos. And we just put that on a grilled cheese sandwich with some cilantro and onions and some very good dipping sauce. That sounds and amazing. And it's just blowing everything out of competition. Okay, so I'm going to take a bite of your, uh, is this avocado? Yeah, avocado grilled cheese. And while I do that, I want you to tell everyone, we mentioned earlier, you guys have a giveaway going on for people who can get some gr free grilled cheese, some coupons. Uh, tell us about the giveaway today. All right, so this is how things are going to work today. In every grilled cheese location today, we're going to have the first 50 customers are going to get a random coupon or as a giveaway. This coupon would either give them uh, one individual free sandwich, a side of fries, or some mac and cheese, drinks, a little treats on us. And then one big ticket winner is going to get, pardon my reach, is going to get this, which is our Willy Wonka golden ticket. This bad boy gets you one grilled cheese per month for the next year. So we got your cheese covered right there. So this is what I mean. Joseph is literally the Willy Wonka of grilled cheese today. Um, number one, incredible avocado. It's like avocado bacon in here. Love the mix up that you have and all of these options that we have look incredible. Um, tell us more about where you guys are located and how customers can order. So we have four locations running right now. Two of them are here local in San Diego. One is in Mission Valley Friars Mall. The other one is in Otay Ranch next to the Millennia apartment complex. Uh, and then we have two more in Orange County, one in Irvine and one in Huntington Beach by the Huntington Beach Pier. Um, every, every location is open up for grabs today. You can come in, have fun. We're going to have loud music, party, balloons. It's going to be good vibes only today. Uh, you can order online through our website. You can order through third-party aggregators like Uber, Uber Eats, GrabHub, DoorDash, Postmates. Um, you can call us in for your order, or you can just come into the store and we'll take care of you. All right, and then right before you go, Joseph, do you have a favorite, a personal favorite on your menu? My absolute fa personal favorite is the Texas grilled cheese. It has that shredded barbecue short rib crunchy onion rings and those cold pickled jalapenos inside. I think the combination of flavors and textures just can't and compete to me. 
Look at that. It's right here. Joseph, thank you for being with us this morning. We got that right here that we're looking at. It looks incredible. Perfect. I know. I got to take a bite of this one. Okay, I'm going to take a bite of this one. Joseph, thank you for being with us. Carrie and Netta, you guys also have some options with you, right? Joseph, we cannot thank you enough. He sent so many options. What do you have, Carrie? I picked the Philly cheese steak. Deep. Okay, sounds Looks good. so good. Mm -hmm. Smells good. And look at how hearty that is. This one's lobster and cheese. Can we bite it on day? Yeah. Oh. You have to tell us how it tastes. I mean, the, and like you mentioned, there are plenty of locations. You got plenty of options. It, mm -hmm. How is it? Well, oh it's way better than the one I made my kids yesterday. <laughs> That's exactly what I meant. I was like, I just, it's tough. It's tough to make a quality grilled cheese, like I said, without burning the, right. you know, the bread or the getting it gooey in the middle. It. Yeah, I like the buttery goodness of the bread, so good. right? Mm -hmm. my it kids, has a little kick to this one. Is it the good? lobster and cheese. Oh, it's so good. So good. I, mean, I didn't so know really. more went into a grilled cheese mm. than cheese, so That's I've right. been educated today. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Evan.